Okay. I think we're fucking... I think we're fucking streaming now. I think we're good. It's taking... It's getting like longer and longer every day before I go live when I go live. That's alright. Okay. Uh, so I guess last night you get the engagement. You get the engagement with uh, China and India. So now they're, they're tit for tat smoking each other. What up? What up? Who's that? What up, Mr. May? Ho- howdy. So, and then the, uh, so the, so the Chinese, the Chinese and the Indians have started shooting at each other for keeps. They're, they're, they're taking lives, taking lives. That's pretty, that's pretty par for the course, right? Like we're, it's not that, it, like people are like, uh, people are like, oh my God, did you see it? It's uh, like, I mean, we're not really even started yet. They're going to, I mean, they're going to be fucking engaged in a war no matter what, whether it's, whether it's in their border region or if it's uh, an isolated conflict in the, in the mountain region, even separate from World War Three. But it'll be, it'll be used to it to pull the United States in, right? If, if they think they can get away with it. That's what it'll be used for. Not that surprising. The big thing that'll draw the United States in, obviously, is Chinese, Chinese Americans in the idea beginning to set up that narrative. But that is what you'll see. You're going to see, you're going to see the control apparatus. It's actually going to be a great opportunity. Because anybody who who pushes uh, Chinese like subversive uh, narrative early on, I'm saying because there are there are Chinese spies here, so like don't don't get me wrong there, you do have Chinese spies here, but uh, the people like I would say like the first like year or half a year that the uh, whenever the MSM starts doing this starts talking about Chinese infiltration in the United States, anybody in the United States that talks about that is pretty much like. Uh, either either directly compromised or fucking might as well be because they just do what they're told and what they get paid to say. And that is, uh, you're going to see who that is right up front. And uh, it'll probably be a good roadmap for that. Painting the picture, painting the picture of who they are up. Drinking some coffee. So, uh, <clears throat> okay. So anyway, so so the the Ladakh engagement, and it's not let's get to World War Three. Okay, let's talk. The Alp, um, I I don't know. You t- it's up to, it's up to you, there, toilet flusher. How much poo I fucking play with today? You tell you tell me. The uh video last night I watched it uh, like late as fuck when I was getting ready to go to bed I watched it you know the gentleman so if you hadn't seen it Albuquerque shooting is it kind of takes place there's a couple different angles from different uh, cell phones but basically you've got you know it's like a uh, like pull down the erase erase all evidence of uh, the confederacy pull down the statue type of operation with the uh, Antifa and stuff and then it's uh, and then it's the um uh, like blue shirt guy, which I don't even know his backstory. I've heard, you know, it's like all speculation. Like maybe he's like a, a local politician guy there, or maybe he's in the militia. Like, I don't fucking know. It doesn't matter. It doesn't even matter at all. So the, uh, the blue shirt guy, fucking old blue shirt shirt homie, uh, you know, I watched that shooting video. I think the fucking, the blue shirt, the blue shirt guy ought to be ashamed of himself. He ought to be fucking ashamed because his his groups were probably really wide. He looked like he shot really hastily, and it, I didn't even see any. Nobody got shot in the head. There were no headshots at all. The um, the fucking guy like walked like uh, 12 feet after after being struck. So I imagine his, I imagine he's got sloppy groupings. His fucking grip looked loose as fuck. He looked like he was fucking fucking popping that bitch all over the place. I don't you know like.
No T zone. No T zone in the video whatsoever. I didn't see. At least I didn't see. I don't know if there's. He may have. He may have. The guy's head might have been made out of steel and deflected off or something. But. And he didn't even die. And he didn't even die. The guy that he shot apparently. So that's that's poor shot placement. Okay. <laughs> The fucking guy, the fucking guy he shot was trying to hit him with a fucking skateboard. You fucking idiot. He should have got shot twice in the fucking face at that range. It should have been the, the 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 camera, the camera guy, the person, the chick or whoever it was at the fucking camera, should have been like permanently traumatized by blood, by fucking brain materials splatter hitting her fucking camera. So then she fuck right off and never go to a fucking mob assault again, assaulting some fucking guy. It doesn't even matter. It it makes no fucking like I I would not be out like guarding uh, statues, you know, unless they were in proximity to my house. If they were in proximity to my house, and so when I come down there pulling the bitches down, I would pretty. They could be a fucking statue of fucking like Karl Marx, and I would still fucking out there and. Uh, at least, like, keep tabs on shit because I don't want fuckers out there by my house, like, pulling down shit. It doesn't really matter what it is. I just don't want, like, an organized Antifa group. Like, if, if, now this is in a public, this is, this is obviously in, like, I'm assuming it's downtown Albuquerque. I've been to Albuquerque in a while, so I couldn't tell. It didn't really look like, uh, <laughs> Like they, they were they were just like pulling down statues and this guy was out there for whatever reason, it doesn't really matter, but these motherfuckers are like trying to fucking they're basically trying to hit him with a skateboard and they and they like thought their fucking skateboards were made out of fucking cotton candy or something. Because uh, this guy was getting like rolled on the ground and he decided like he was like he was like he 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 disagreed with him that he felt like dying that day. <laughs> so he so he fucking fucking shot that guy. <laughs> <laughs> the uh fuck I can't read the comments I got too much sun in my eyes I can't read <sighs> I mean it's it's going to happen a lot more like you're going to start seeing people like as this thing gets intensified you are going to see a lot of shootings you're going to see you're going to see both sides of shootings uh, of these synthetic fake ass fucking sides, you're gonna see both of them get fucking pumped up, and the media's gonna pump them up. And the only thing that the only thing that the media gave a fuck about after the shooting was like what their response was gonna be to this guy, which basically means that they know that they can't fucking do anything. Because obviously, obviously, a fucking completely textbook fucking like I mean, you'd have to go backwards in time and rewrite fucking self defense law for the state of New Mexico to to get this guy or anything. So like. They're, the media, regardless of that, regardless of how clean the shooting was, I mean, I, I think there's literally in the fucking video, there's literally a voice that says, like, I'm going to kill you. And he's, like, he's like fucking head down with, like, his hands on top of his head, like, trying to, de in a defensive position. And then some fucking retard comes running out there with a skate, like, grabs a skateboard off the ground that was already there, tries to pick the motherfucker up and strike the guy with it. And then he fucking, like, pulls out a gun and is obviously, like, he's not stand there aiming everything he's just like whipping around in a circle from his uh like from his fucking reverse guard position and then trying to like trying to fucking like shoot like who who's hitting me with skateboards <laughs> like fucking shooting like it's the most textbook fucking self shoot self defense shooting i've ever seen in a while for like an unarmed you know for like a i mean i don't want to say unarmed because they're heavily armed heavily armed skateboard attackers ninja attackers <laughs> have, have armed heavily with truck with, with fucking skateboard wheel trucks fuck man alright I, I gotta go I'll do, 